Hey everybody, welcome to EFT. We're gonna do a tapping meditation right now. Take a nice deep breath in and out. So this tapping meditation is gonna focus on clearing negative energy picked up from others. So we've all had that person in our lives where after the interaction, something doesn't feel right. And when I think of resentments and anger and blame, you know, even gossip, right? There's a reason why we need to do that. And there's a way that the brain replays over and over interactions that we have with people so that our brain can puff ourselves up. Um, and we want to get out of that. We want to set aside what we think we know is right so that we can have a new experience. So we want to clear that negativity off of us. And the most important thing is we want to stop taking things personally. You can be assured that whatever is going on with that person and however they ended up making you feel was not about you. And so it's really important before we get started to open our minds so that we can receive love and forgiveness and tolerance and patience, not only for others, but for ourselves, right? So right now, I'm going to have you take a pen and paper out. And every time we do a tapping meditation together, I'm going to have you journal and track the emotions and thoughts that come up. The first thing that we're going to do is um, rate the, the intensity of the emotion before we start. And at the end, we also rate it again. And this is great feedback for when we meet one-on-one. -on -one. It's great feedback for you as you continue to do these tapping meditations daily you're training your brain how to calm your central nervous system. So think about an interaction that you've had with someone that left you feeling unsettled. This tapping meditation is exactly for this experience. Tune into your body and notice the stress you feel when you think of that interaction, that person. From a scale to one, to zero, excuse me, zero to 10, rate your experience. Mark it on your paper. Let's begin. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. We always start on the karate chop point. You're gonna follow me, tap gently, on the side of your hand. As always, we start with the negative statements telling the truth about how we feel so we can release them through the tapping and then we will allow and move towards the pod positive. Repeat after me. Even though I am feeling unsettled after interacting with this person, I honor how I feel and I am ready to let go of this energy. Even though I'm feeling this negative energy from our interaction, I accept how I feel and I am ready to release this energy. Even though my energy is off after being with this person, I honor how I feel and I choose to find my center. We're going to start on our eyebrow. I feel so unsettled. Okay to use your tone 
and sarcasm and that negativity to bring up the emotion. All this negative energy. You're going to tap on the side of your temple. All this negative energy. Under your eye, this negative energy between us. A C around your mouth. It's just this heavy energy in the room. On your clavicle, no wonder I feel so unsettled. You're gonna slap your stomach. I honor how I feel. You're gonna move under your armpit, armpit to the side of your body here and pat. Something didn't feel right. Gonna go to the back of your wrist. This interaction let, left me feeling unsettled. Gonna move to between your fifth and fourth metacarpal bones. Simply think about the interaction between you and this person and focus on that feeling. We're gonna move to the top of your head. How did it feel during the interaction? So you can just think to yourself, how did it feel during that interaction? You can just think about the interaction as I guide you, you're gonna to continue to tap and follow me. Follow to your eyebrow. Notice how your body feels after the interaction. On your temple, notice any tension as you relax into the awareness of your body. Underneath your eye. Feel the awareness and how it brings you freedom. A C around your mouth. Feeling centered and grounded. Bring to mind what happened in the interaction. On your clavicle, feeling centered and grounded, how did it make you feel? Now slap your belly, continue to focus on what happened. Gonna go to underneath your armpit on the side of your body. Notice the feelings and thoughts around the situation that come up. On the back of your wrist, think about how these feelings were letting you know there was something off. You're gonna to move to the back of your hand between the fifth and fourth. As you bring to mind how this interaction feels, let your body relax.
on the top of your head as you bring to mind how this interaction feels, you let your body relax. On your eyebrow, it's safe to relax now. On the side of your temple, think about how these feelings were letting you know there was something off. underneath your eye. Notice that you are giving your energy and power away in this moment. A C around your mouth. Be grateful you had the awareness something was off. On your clavicle, it's time to take your power back. I'm ready to take my power back. On your belly, imagine interacting with this person in the future. Instead of being pulled down by their energy or their complaints, notice yourself feeling grounded and centered in your body. On the side of your body, underneath your armpit, repeat after me. I can be grounded and centered in my body. Notice how you can be there for someone without needing to take on their problems. on the back of your wrist, I feel grounded and centered. Notice what it feels like to be grounded and centered while you interact with this person. On the back of your hand, continue to imagine yourself present, but disconnected to the other person. No matter what, you, Choose to stay calm and grounded in your body. Repeat after me. I stay grounded in my body. We're going to go to the top of the head. Sometimes I take on others' negative energy. Repeat after me. Sometimes I take on negative energy. On your eyebrow, part of me takes it on because I want to fix it. Repeat after me. Part of me takes it on because I want to fix it. On your temple, I like being there for others. underneath your eye. I like being there for others. A C around your mouth. I recognize I take on too much. On your clavicle. As I feel centered and relaxed in my body, I find clarity. As I feel centered and relaxed in my body, I find clarity. On your belly, I am open to finding clarity. Underneath your armpit, maybe I need to create more distance with this person. I want you to think of a bubble around you protecting you when you're near this person, that you can put up your imaginary bubble and shield. On the back of your wrist, maybe I need to be there without taking on their energy. On 
on the back of your hand between four and five. I am responsible for my energy. I am responsible for my energy on the top of your head. On your eyebrow, I can't control how anyone else feels. On the temple, I am responsible for my energy. Underneath your eye, I choose to feel centered and strong. A C around your mouth. Before any future interactions with this person, I make sure I feel centered and strong. On your clavicle, I can only give what I have. On your belly, I choose to feel peace now. On the back, oh, let's go to the armpit. I choose to feel centered and strong right now. On the back of your wrist, allowing my energy to feel light once again. I can create my own boundaries on the back of your hand. I can create my own boundaries. On the top of your head, I allow my energy to feel light. Okay, you're gonna shake your arms out a little bit. You're gonna take a nice deep breath in and blow out. As you exhale, check in with how you feel. On the scale of zero to 10, rate your intensity of the experience from this interaction. Any shift towards zero, know that you are headed in the right direction. If the number is the same or higher, repeat this tapping again. Include thoughts and feelings you have about clearing this negative energy. You can change the words of the meditation. If words come into your mind, that's a good thing. It means your mind is focused on what you are bringing up and it's ready to release. As we tap on these points, the meridian and energy flow is being cleared and opening up your mind. It's calming your central, central nervous system and allowing you to think in the frontal part of your brain instead of the fight and flight part of your brain, the brain stem. So we wanna use tapping to integrate our brain, get our brain back online so it can use all of its function and all of its potential to problem solve and to bring you in the moment and keep you present. You can do this tapping before an event before and after you are in contact with someone who is a trigger for you, if you already know they're a trigger, this is valuable because you can add your own thoughts and feelings while you tap. So take this time to connect with your body and notice where you feel. I want you to journal and track where you are in this, with this particular interaction so that the next time we tap on it, you can see the progress you're making. And if you get stuck, that's what I'm here for. So happy tapping. I'll talk to you again soon.